Oh, hi, Mark. Day 21 of 31 days, 31 recommendations. That's right, we're actually doing it, boys and girls. We are 10 days away from completing 31 days in a row where I've uploaded, with a few exceptions, uh, because I suck. And, <laughs> and um, not only do I suck, but uh, I'm unavailable to upload on certain days, so like I just upload multiple days at once. Anyway, we're not here to talk about my faults. We are here to talk about Trick or Treat. This is a 1980s movie. Uh, yeah, not Trick or Treat. That movie's awesome as well. I think I've already recommended that one. I'll have to go back and see. If I haven't, then that's definitely coming up, which I shouldn't have told you because that ruins the surprise. But Trick or Treat, this is an awesome 1980s movie. It does have Ozzy Osbourne and Gene Simmons in it. They're in it about two minutes a piece. Actually, I think Ozzy Osbourne has like less than two minutes of run or of, of screen time. Uh, Ozzy Osbourne's role is really funny though. Jim, Gene Simmons' role feels fairly um, like yeah, that's the thing I could see Gene Simmons doing. I'm pretty sure he's like a radio DJ. Uh, but as far as Audi Ozzy Osbourne goes, his role in this movie is hilarious. Like I said, it lasts about a minute and a half, so it's. Uh, <laughs> It's it's not super. Uh, oh, what am I what am I trying to say? It's not super expansive. It's, it's not super present. He's not in the movie a lot. <laughs> but anyway, this movie's about like a uh, kid who summons some rock and roll like dead rock and roll guy. I haven't seen this in a while. I actually do need to rewatch this. Uh, I introduced my buddy to it. He loved it. So it's not just me. <laughs> It's not just me. I, I think this movie's uh, generally pretty well regarded. And I don't know. I would recommend it pretty highly. I think it's a really, really fun time.